position to come. Let's see if it drops down. Yep, you see, the robot is at work. And soon it's going to drop down. Hi guys, my name is Peace and I'm traveling around the world. So let's peace out and go. Hello guys, if you have watched my recent video of my trip to the longest pedestrian suspension bridge, you have heard me say this. So, I was really hurt and I was even in the hospital uh, treated for it as I will share with you on a different video, a separate video just about that. The reason I would do that is to give you a lesson for life. The lesson for life that I had not to uh, uh, fall again in that category of being dumb. Because if you do, you won't be just dumb, you'll be dumb and dumber. <laughs> Oh yeah, and if you haven't watched this video, make sure you are watching it right after this video. The link is going to be in the description below, so go and watch it and enjoy it. Okay, so now let me take you back to that miserable incident at the time when it happened, while I was visiting this old ancient city called Lagos in South Portugal. And I'll show you the way I handled it and what we have to learn from it, which is the most important thing, not to be dumb. <laughs> Yeah, so these are my two burned hands, as you see. They might not seem as bad as they look, but I can tell you one thing. This was very, very, very bad. And when I say bad, I mean I couldn't sleep, I couldn't move, I couldn't uh, lay my hands on anything because it was burning like a fire. All right, so I'm uh, walking on the streets of Lagos right after having a ride in the ocean. And I'm a white guy after all. So as you see, my hand became red fire in just uh, about an hour at the ocean under the sun. And I must look for uh, something to cover my hands. So I'm in search of uh, cream because my hands are burning now. So let's uh, see where we can find something like this. ATM, bank, not, a bank is not gonna help me now, right? Even if I have a million dollars, my hands are still gonna burn, aren't they? So, let's look for, I don't see anything in here. Tell you the truth, some kind of pharmacy or something. Let me check. All right, let me see here. Surf lessons. No, not about to surf now again. I had my surfing share in the sea. Oh, this was a crazy ride. You have no freaking idea. It was a speedy boat going like crazy. And I lost my butt and my back. Whatever you can even think of. This is why I'm so back down now. Right, so finally I found one and it's even burning even harder now. It's burning even more now, but at least I do something, I put something on it. So let's hope I'm gonna feel better soon. Okay, bye bye. Okay guys, so this is the hospital in Lagos where I went to get treated for the sunburn which I got on both of my hands. I was literally the only one patient there at midnight. Well, it's a little city, I guess, and uh, not much is happening there, but uh, at least I found a place to get treated for and that was good. So it's Saturday midnight. I was just visiting the hospital, the local little hospital in uh, Lagos because of my sunburn uh, on my two hands. And right now I'm going to uh, find uh, a local pharmacy which is open 24 hours in order to buy a special cream which the doctor recommended that I use so I can continue with my uh, visit here. So here's the pharmacy. Uh, it's closed right now but what you need to do is go to this window and press the button and somebody will come. Hi. As you can see, 
can see, here's the pharmacy. It's quite modernized. It has like a uh, robot uh, machine which would bring the medicine or the cream that was uh, in the pres prescription for me. As you can see, she's inside doing her job. Let me see if I can see it from here. You see on the top are all the medications in, uh, laid out especially for that robot, which will drop down the, uh, the uh, medicine for me. So I'm waiting. Here's the sticker I got from the hospital and I'm waiting for the medicine to come. Let's see if it drops down. Yep, you see, the robot is at work. And soon it's going to drop down in a minute. Boom, 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 let me see quickly. And you see, yep, it drops down, you see that? One item is dropped down, and I guess the other one is coming down. You see? You see that? Wow! This is so amazing. In Portugal, far north, a pharmacy being so sophisticated is quite, uh, I would say, an amazing thing to see. So she's working a night shift, and she's gonna hand me the medicine from that window, right from there. And uh, let's hope that it will take care of my sunburn so I can continue my visit and bring you the best content in the world. Let's have a smile after all. <laughs> okay, so as you see, it's quiet. Most of the people are sleeping. You see the beautiful alleys behind me of the old town of Lagos. Here she is coming. See. Thirteen sixty nine. Thirteen sixty nine. Okay. Thirteen. One three. One three. All right. Just a second. You like our system? <laughs> I love your system. It's amazing. I mean, uh, to see such a sophisticated with a robot, I didn't see it anywhere else. And in Lagos, to find it is quite <laughs> nice. <laughs> it's nice. I like it. Okay. Can you do it? Yes, uh, let me uh, put it in. So here we go. Here's the medicine and the receipt. Uh, let me just ask you the cream. Mm -hmm. How many times a day should I should I uh I, I wrote on the box for you? It's every, I think it's every six hours. Every six hours. Now if I go out tomorrow, uh, is it better I wear long sleeves, right? Sunburn? Yes, a hard sunburn. Better. Better a long sleeve. Okay, so I don't need a skin uh, protector cream you, on top. If you go in the sun, yes, without long sleeve. No, with the long sleeve. No, with the long. No. You don't need. No. Okay. okay. I really appreciate your help. I prefer, uh, white clothes. White clothes? Because it reflects the sun rays. I see. So a light color. That's what you say. Yes. yes. All right. Thank you so much. You're Have a great night. <laughs> Thank you, bye-bye. Okay, so you heard it all. We'll need to buy a long sleeve shirt tomorrow. Yeah, yeah this is it. Yep. Okay guys, so as I said in the beginning, the purpose of this video was to teach you a lesson for life. Well, that lesson which I was taught by my mistake of getting out for hours under the sun while I'm traveling without any protection whatsoever. And you know what that means. That means stupid. <laughs> so please, do not be that stupid as I was. And whenever you're planning to go for an adventure outside, wherever it is, for a trip, for fun, for vacation, whatever it is, and you're planning to be under the sun for many hours on the ocean or wherever you go to, remember one very important thing. The most essential product that you should take with you before you get out there is a sun protector cream. You should not do the same mistake as I did. Well, guys, if you have liked this video, you know what you gotta do. Give it a like, please. It doesn't cost you anything and it makes me proud. <laughs> well, it helps me a lot. So thank you very much for watching. And right now, before you leave, make sure you're watching the next video coming up.